am Sonali Mahajan, Assistant Professor in KVNI College. Welcome to all in our channel MS Chemistry. In our previous lecture, we already discussed about some protecting groups of alcohol. Okay. In today's lecture, we are going to discuss about uh, protection of diols. Diols means uh, having two OH, two oil groups means diol. There is presence of two OH groups. They are two types means 1,2 diols and as well as 1,3 diols are there. Okay. Uh, for protection of 1,2 diol, we require acetone in H+. And for protection of 1,3 diol, we require PHCHO in H+, or CH, uh, CH3CHO in H+. Okay. In this way, we can protect uh, diol. Okay. So, for uh, there is OH and OH. 1 and 2 position. There is two alcohols are present, hence we call as diol. Diol, okay. And the position is 1 and 2. That's why 1, 2 diol. Likewise, for 1, 3 diol, there is also two OH groups, that is two alcohol groups present on 1, 2, and 3. Means 1, 3 position. That's why we call it. 1, 3, diol. Okay. So, first of all, we discuss about 1, 2, diol. 1, 2, diol. For protection of 1, 2, diol, there is three ways to protect 1, 2, diol. Okay. This is 1, 2, diol. This is ketone functional group. In presence of H plus, that is acidic condition, this oxygen is behave as like a acid uh, character. Means this carbonyl is behave like acidic character, and it will becomes O H positive. There is three bonds on oxygen atom, hence it carries positive charge. So next to that. This OH will, this OH will behave like a nucleophile and it will attach over this carbonyl carbon and it will become, this hydrogen is shifted over this oxygen and it becomes OH, H positive, OH, H and this H is positive and here this two R groups and O sorry diol 1 2 diol is there so O H okay in this way this lone pair of oxygen is shifted over this uh, bond and these water molecules get uh, depart and formation of these two methyl groups or R groups and here formation of double bond. Formation of double bond in between oxygen and carbon and another group is remains as it is. Okay, one carbon, two carbon and OH. One, two carbon and OH. So again here formation of positive charge. Formation of positive charge. So what will happen next? This oxygen also having lone pairs of electron. So, they will shift it over this carbon and it will become, it will stabilize this positive charge. Here this oxygen, this two carbon and this one is OH. Okay. So, in solvent there is any base is present, that base will abstract this hydrogen atom and it will becomes, it will becomes neutral. Means it will become oxygen and formation of this acetal group. Formation of this acetal functional group. This is one way to protect this diode. There is also Two ways to all, uh, protect this dial. Okay. Got it? 
no second one is there in which two methoxy groups are present two methoxy groups are present okay in presence of h plus in presence of h plus what will happen here here this ome plus ome is lone pair will abstract this hydrogen okay will abstract this proton and it will becomes this ome as it is and here it will becomes me and eh positive okay so this lone pair of oxygen will shifted over here and this group will depart and formation of this two methyl and here double bond o me okay again oxygen carrying positive charge oxygen will carry positive charge so here our diol is comes to react and it will reacts like a nucleophile it will attacks over this carbonyl carbon and it will get neutralized it will becomes here this o me and this hydrogen this here positive charges of the and now this two me we can write here and here o and this diol group okay so the oxygen lone pair will again delocalize and this meoh group will remove and here formation of these two r groups and double bond oxygen double bond oxygen then to carbon to carbons and here o h okay again here oxygen carrying positive charge so there is this lone pair of oxygen will shifted over here and this charge will get stabilized and here formation of these two r groups oxygen two carbons this uh, oxygen attach over here this hydrogen is abstracted by uh, base present in solvent okay so again we protect one diol functional group by means of this group and formation of acetone okay this is second way now third one is o me here me or we can uh, remain it like this okay in presence of h plus in presence of acidic condition what will happen here the oxygen lone pair will shifted over this carbon uh, this bond and this bond will carry this proton and this sp2 hybridization hybridization will becomes sp3 here okay and here formation of o me and here positive charge this one okay so we can write here me also or not okay again in second condition there is presence of this group there is um, in reaction the group is observed like this so again same mechanism is there this oxygen lone pair will attacks over this uh, carbonyl carbon and this oxygen charge will stabilize and it will becomes me h sorry again it carry a um, positive charge o h okay and here one me group me me okay so the lone pair of oxygen goes over here and this meoh group will get the part hmm? meoh so here formation of oxygen this two r groups this one me group is as it is the oxygen carbon having double bond and formation of positive charge over here the lone pair of oxygen will 
लोकेट ओवर हियर एंड फॉर्मेशन ऑफ लाइक वाइज दिस हाइड्रोजन इज एब्सट्रेक्टेड इन सॉल्वेंट ओके सो इन दिस वे दिस थर्ड थर्ड टाइप ऑफ प्रोटेक्शन इज ऑल्सो डन सो हियर वन टू टाइप्स ऑफ डायल आर देर ओके इन चेयर कन्फर्मेशन इन चेयर कन्फर्मेशन देर इज ओ एच डायल्स आर प्रेजेंट इन डिफरेंट जोमेट्रीज मीन्स डिफरेंट कन्फर्मेशन मीन्स हियर वन ओ एच इज बिलो द प्लेन एंड दिस ओ एच इज ऑल्सो बिलो सो दिस वन इज सिस दिस वन है सिस जोमेट्री हियर दिस ओ एच इज बिलो एंड दिस ओ एच इज अबो सो इट है डिफरेंट मीन्स ट्रांस जोमेट्री In this case also, this one having below and this one having above geometry, so it is also trans. Here one is above, second one is also above. So this is also cis. This having also cis geometry. In this case, this one is above, this one is below. Means trans type of geometry. Below above, trans geometry. Here below above trans geometry. Here below below means cis geometry. One, two, and three. Three types of cis conformations are there. Uh, so these only performing uh, or this uh, OH or these diodes only get protected. Not these or these these diodes are not going to protect. Only cis type of diode is going to. protect if we uh, see the example for example we can take this uh, type of dial okay in which this oh is also below and this oh is also below so by three ways we can protect it means in presence of acetone in h plus or in presence of ome ome in h plus or O M E M E in presence of H plus. By these three ways, we can protect this diode. So here formation of this O H is below the plane and this one is also below the plane. Here if this oxygen and this oxygen is get protected. Okay. This type of acetal is formed. So, in chair conformation, they require geometry is cis geometry. So, I will take here some uh, examples in which O H O H means diodes are present. Okay, here one two as well as one two three diode is present. Okay, so in presence of acetone. Which one is protected? Only one two diode is get protected. This O H is having above geometry, and this O H is also having above geometry. So these two having cis geometry, and only these two will get protected. Okay, and a five member ring is formed. Five member ring is formed because five member ring is formed because there is um. Five member ring is stable. Okay. In second uh, example, here one two one two one two. These are uh, OH are present. Okay. But here only uh, this terminal OH will form. Uh, only terminal OH will get protected. Okay. In presence of Me three C O Me two means this is. In presence of uh, this catalyst. Only terminal OH will get protected, not this one, because these two, if we protect these two also, so here this will get protected. Okay, this will get also protected below now, and this one will also get protected. So what will be happen if we protect all the OH groups or all the diol groups? so there is crowded structure is formed for um, 
crowded structure is formed so that's why we only protect terminal dials we only going to protect terminal dials and not the center dial that's why this structure is stable one okay this structure is stable structure these are one to dials example one to dial protection example okay now one three dial protection now we are going to discuss about one three dial protection for one three dial protection we require one two three this kind of dial okay uh, these are maybe cis or maybe trans both dials are get protected by uh, pyridine psoh means uh, toluene sulfonic acid in presence of ph uh, phenyl benzene okay so what will happen this um, dials are get protected and this de protection is carried out in presence of h2 pdoh2 in presence of ethanol okay uh, this 13 dial is get de protected and now we will discuss about its mechanism if we have uh, the benzophenone like this and we add h plus into it so there is formation of this type of uh, molecules okay so in which one three dial is get added this one three dial this oxygen will attacks over this carbonyl carbon and it will becomes it will becomes o h okay and here o h okay so from solvent this base is having positive charge uh, this boron has positive charge and this hydrogen has a negative charge this oxygen will abstract this uh, hydrogen okay and um, it will becomes o h 2 positive o h 2 positive and here these groups are as it is okay so by shifting this lone pair of oxygen this water will get removed and formation of and here formation of double bond oxygen and oh 1 2 3 oh and here positive charge okay so the lone pair of oxygen will again attacks over this carbon and it will becomes this hydrogen is abstracted by base and the charge is yet stabilized in here formation of this kind of acetal okay we can also write it like this means ph okay we got our product in this way we can protect one three dial and for the protection of this we can use h2 in presence of pdoh2 pdoh2 in presence of ethanol we can deprotect this acetal in one three dial in one three dial okay in this way our one three dial is also done okay Uh, so i hope you all understand his this lecture uh, thank you so much for